Welcome to Star Wars Lost Hyperspace, a Star Wars podcast where we talk about everything Star Wars. Punch it. You thunder against me. You have done that yourself. There's nothing more we could have done. There's too much Vader in him. The boy you trained, gone he is. Hello there, everybody. Welcome to Star Wars Lost Hyperspace. Um, today we're going to talk about two episodes of Star, uh, Star Wars Vision. And um, it's going to be Rhapsody, Tatooine Rhapsody, and um, the, the Twins. Um, I'm your host, Isaac Wilder. Um, as usual, I'm here with my friend... Matthew Manchester. Watch and watch, everyone. Um, yeah, uh, Matthew, what do you, let's go to our first, um, uh, uh, the second episode of Vision called Raps, Tatooine Rap City. What did you think of it? I think, I think it's the, it's interesting that they decided to, imp- to include some modern music. What do you say? Music that's from our universe. And they somehow transferred it. They bought, they took it. They took our music and took it and got it far, far away from us. What do you say? No. Uh, yeah. Well, it, it, I, it, I, it was, I, I think it was interesting, but I'm, I'm asking you, like, what do you think of the uh, the whole entire episode? I think that it's interesting in the sense that the setup is of the jet of this Jedi. Um, he escapes Order sixty six and the uh, and hides by being part of this band. Mm-hmm. And the whole idea of what happened with the hut, where you s- the whole. Thing about the hut, what caused the what was the conflict there? The um, the hut was that was part of the band decided to not follow Jabba the Hut's um yeah. thing, and then the band had to perform in order to save his life. Basically, that was an interesting. <laughs> Concept. Yeah, um, I actually found that episode just a tiny bit. You, you didn't like it. Did well, you? yeah, I told you I didn't like it, but uh, I found that that episode just a bit strange. It's not this, Star Wars. <laughs> I, it's, it's not I, Star Wars. Well, that's to me. You you said you you liked it. I think it's neat that they brought. Modern, mm-hmm. oh, more like jazz, or was it rock band? No, rock band, rock band, yeah, into Star Wars. I for me, I found that strange because it was like okay, the story first began with this, began during Order 66. There, that's probably my guess. And this uh, pad one was running away from. I don't know if it'll be stormtroopers or droids. We couldn't really tell. Uh, well, the, clone troopers. Oh uh, yeah, st- clone troopers or droids, whatever they were. And um, he falls into this area, and then suddenly he goes unconscious. And then somehow this hot found him, and he joined. He he basically asked him to join his band, and then. 
so the 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 pad one's lightsaber was destroyed, and he goes to this rock band, and uh, it's now a mic, and then it it's became so. Uh, when Boba Fett comes on to the band one time, shoots them down, and to find this hot, this hot that was that owned a, that was a. That Jabba the Hutt wanted Jabba the Hutt send Boba Fett to go find him, and when he finds him, he's in this band, and then he refused to come. And then this, I I I guess, and then um uh, sorry, and then um in the trailer you thought he, that was, in the trailer you thought that was Boba Fett's ship, well a ship that looked like that had Boba Fett's head or something. But it was Boba Fett himself no, flying I, with the chip pack. The no, trailer. I didn't think that was Boba Fett's ship. I thought it was. I didn't think that was Boba Fett's ship. Yeah, it can't be. I thought Boba it Fett was ship. just Boba Fett. That's what I said earlier. I thought it was Boba Fett, but um, but uh, I misunderstood. No, yeah, I I didn't think it was Boba. I didn't think it was Boba Fett's ship. I thought it, it can't was Boba be Fett. A ship, but. The yeah. Helmet. Yeah. I was telling you it was Boba Fett. I had to re- pause it and pause it back on and back and forth to show you. Uh-huh. So whatever. Anyway, it was um. So Boba Fett comes and captures the hot and takes him back. Was going back to his ship and then the boy comes back. I think this time maybe he was a maybe many years later he was a teenager and. Uh, he turns on his lightsaber. It's broken. It, yeah, it was broken. It turns into a mic later. And then later on, when they decide to go find the hearts, they decide to go rescue the heart that... There were a group. There was a droid, an alien creature, and with, a ham, and then a heart. A guy I, with I don't, three heads. Yeah, a guy with three... An alien with three heads. Actually, yeah, yeah, three heads. And it was all strange to me. So that episode was now my top favorite. And then they had they had this rock band, and also the music and the singing just seemed a little jazz. No oh, rock. It rock. was rock. Uh, the mu the music. No, for me, so the music. The, just the singing just seemed a little off. <laughs> like when I watched it, when I when I watched it, and after that episode ended, I was like. I paused for like two minutes. I was like, wow, that was strange. <laughs> that's how that's how I felt like. Um uh, and you probably felt you probably felt different about it. But for me I just felt it was What a, a strange episode. It was it was a it was a change. Like some people might say that it's good for a change for once in a while, but I don't know <laughs> whether this, it was... It's not... I guess I'm saying it's not something I want to see. Twice. <laughs> it's not an episode I would watch you more want, than once. It's an episode it I, like, I would put... Like, the other episode I felt pretty good about. The other Vision epi- Visions episode I felt really good. Just coming to the episode was like... This is weird. <laughs> I was not expecting that. Yeah, the, yeah. Was it weird that at the end he says, "Java won't be our first uh, sponsor." sponsor. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and Java's um, crew was basically the. What do you say? What do you call the? I don't know. The people that are the po- broadcasters, like they, they are, even had they're the we like the huts job of the hut and his crew is the way it was the reason why people that weren't there were able to see it, like like why we were able to see things on the news or uh-huh. like we get yeah, but my problem yes. My, my, that was my, hard. I didn't care about the the people who were there. I I didn't mind the people there. To me, the music, like the sound, the music, na, 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 was fine to me. It actually, sounded so cool. It's the says, singing, 
I don't know who voiced. I they should probably look it up sometime. But I don't know who voiced the characters, but the singing was way off. I like, was maybe off if, as in as in what they're not, si- what they're saying or the what they're singing. The, like, Why is he pitchy? Yeah, the tone, the tone, and what they're saying just seemed a little... <laughs> not Star Wars. Uh, no, I mean, I, I'm not saying that it doesn't seem Star Wars. It just seems off ah. about the whole singing. And also at the... Um, uh, um, where... where um, at one of the spots when... Um, I don't remember what I was going to say. I was going to say something. Um, Some spot. There was a spot here that... So we, we were just saying about the about the house being the broadcasters, about the music being off. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Helping questions. Uh, no, no, no. That's not what I'm looking for. Um. Uh, what was it? I lost it. But just saying, I actually, I thought it was an okay episode. It's not. Those an ap- who, it's not my lifetime episode. Maybe, I mean, the other ones were. Yeah. The other ones were great. Those out there who like rap. Maybe you might, you guys no. might, you, yeah, right? rock, rock. Yeah. those rock who, band. whatever it may be, I, that's what I said, those who enjoy it, enjoy that type of music, maybe you can consider watching this episode and decide for yourself whether, whether you like it or not. Yeah, I, I, I actually said, oh yeah, that's, this is what's about the thing I was going to say earlier. Okay. I said maybe if I watch this in Japanese, the original language that this was supposed to come out for. Mm-hmm. And it has. Maybe if I watched it that way, I would enjoy watching it because then I wouldn't understand. But you don't want to say it. You, no, you, I wouldn't understand the music. I wouldn't hmm. understand the music. Like, the words the music. You don't and, speak Japanese. Yeah, you no, don't. No, but you, I... You don't read Japanese. No, but I would, I would, I would feel like it would be more... It will feel right. So it will feel right because I wouldn't understand it. And it would just feel maybe right in the right tune to is me. Is it because the words, like when you, if they're singing in something in a language you don't understand, then you don't need to worry about this, the words so much. Yes. It's just uh, yes. music that matters. Yeah, if I, if I watch it in that language, I would not, that would... And if I watched it in that language in the first place, that episode would have not bothered me. Since I watched it in the English horrible mouthing ver- version, uh, I would. <laughs> oh, they were actually speaking in Japanese. And it, they, and they moved you... their mouth. The mouth was supposed to move in Japanese. Oh. Then they, it's like watching a movie in a different language and having trans, a uh, different actor who are voicing the actor. like Bawa, in a, uh, what was what was a movie or TV show that ha, that was that had live action? Someone was speaking in you know, Spanish, I think, and they had maybe you guys watched, maybe uh, you have seen it. And someone else was voicing it in English. I know I saw a movie. Right. I know I saw a, mo- a movie with one of our cousins. One of our cousins, my cousin. Um, but it was, it was in a different language, and I thought it just looked strange to me to watch a movie like that. But, um, I think it was called, um, something with Blade, I don't even remember it. Um, But, um, okay, just, just, it just seemed off to me, and... But one of my greatest, best one that I really enjoyed was the twins. Which is the next episode. Which is the third, the third, right? Yeah. Yeah. The third episode. The twins was amazing. How did you feel about the twins? I think it was, was it odd to you 
that although they were, they were, yes, they were both born into the dark side, right? Mm -hmm. Somehow, they were born into the dark side. Yeah, somehow they combined their DNA to create the dark uh, side the DNA. Dark side children. I don't. It was all confusing. The episode was great, but all confusing to me too. Um. So, this is what happened. The brother goes. The twin. The other twin brother goes to the uh, goes to the sister's ship and steals the energy source that they were supposed to use to destroy planets. Uh, it and, was a double ship. Did you see? Oh uh, yeah, it was. It was like two star destroyer, get all together, but with a big. It was like the, it was like Star Killer base. Um, it was like the thing looked like a Star Killer base type of weapon, but connected to oh, a Star it, Destroyer. It, it and kind of looked was, like two Star Destroyers, but they were attached with a. Yeah, that's where. Uh, I was oh, trying to explain that and... whole like thing that powers the Star Destroyer to uh -huh. fire. That's what I... F and it looked so hilarious. And... It was different. <laughs> and the brother... So the brother steals the... The brother steals the... Uh, crystal? The crystal. And was about to escape with it. But the sister ended up caught... The sister caught him. And then they all started like arguing about... And then he, they, and then they brought up the awesome. And then somehow the sister had six arms. <laughs> six arms. Remember the trailer? <laughs> two left, two right. Yes. And then the trailer. The whole amazing duo. Somehow they could the breathe. The whip. Yeah, whips. Brother. Whip sabers. Yeah. 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 He stopped um, that. But somehow they can breathe out of space. That was a different. Yeah. And, Maybe uh, something associated with their DNA. <laughs> their DNA. Yeah, yeah, really. Uh, and then they were, um, and then he, and then they somehow. So this, basically, at the end of it, is that the brother, that this part of the story has happened to him before, so he like foresaw he foresaw it, right? Uh, he said that this story, this part of. This story has happened before, so he went back to. He so went somehow. To, he went back into the past time travel. I don't know. It kinda made like it, Back to the Future. They kind of did it like. Is it kind of like Back to the Future? Maybe. What do they call it? Yeah, Back to the Future it was like this guy who travels. So his parents are getting. So in the first one, his parents get treated by this guy so mean and so. Rude, and then he time travels back. He, <laughs> it back to the future is confusing, so he travels back into the past, into the past to change what happened. So he accidentally changes, which is also kind of strange because he he rescues his dad, and then his mom started. <laughs> it was just creepy. Uh, <laughs> oh, wait, I think that's enough for right now. But uh, but, but my point is... <laughs> time travel. Time travel. Back to the future. I guess it's a back to the future, though. It's the best. It's the best non-complicated time travel that nothing... Well, something goes wrong in there, but something doesn't go wrong that... It... It I changes mean, what happens uh, in yeah. the future. Like this vision episode, the twins. He sees this part of the story. Story, sorry. This part of the story has happened to him before, and so he, he was in the girl's position. Uh no, but he has seen. So the duel they did yeah. has ha happened before. So he goes back. To change what has happened because he knows in the but future they, his they sister too. in the past his sister died, so yeah. he time travel. They try to make it look like it wasn't a time travel thing, which kind of sounded like a time travel because he says he's foreseen it. Well, he yeah. foreseen his sister died, so basically, and then his sister says, "So you're from the future," and and that they try to keep it. 
away from like <laughs> kind of like what you say is kind of like what in uh, levels how um Ezra went to this yeah, yeah. temple and kind of saved Ahsoka I saw, like how he, from the duel he pulled Ahsoka out of the uh, uh, duel with so at the end of Rebels though I saw we saw Ahsoka we go. saw Darth Vader walk away and then they, with half mask and uh, half of his face was sliced off. And we see Ahsoka in a hole and then the owl lands next to where Ahsoka was. And just so you know, that owl was from the Clone Wars. Uh, bird. She, that bird saved, that was the same bird that saved the woman who saved Ahsoka's that life. That was the, the daughter. The daughter in one of the Clone Wars episodes. Force Wheel. Whichever. Yes. Well, in the Force Wielder episode, I don't even remember. Uh, it's been a long time since I've seen the Clone Wars. It's so. similar with him this case. Yeah, it, yeah. So, um, yeah, the part he goes in and pulls Ahsoka, out, pulls Ahsoka out instead of Kenyon. That's the same type of thing, the brother, I think. The way they were trying to... And also, that's even confusing her. And, yeah, so that's the same thing, the brother. And you did. don't like time travel, but you like this one better than the uh, previous one. More like I like, yeah, more like I like the story. I think the best time travel movie is Back to the Future. That's all I can say. Back uh. to the Future, the one you saw, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I so saw I too. saw it, you saw it, and I think that's, I think that's greater than Endgame, where, where <laughs> the time travel Back to the Future to get the Infinity Stone so they can bring everybody back, but then they bring, something goes wrong, they bring back... And that the thing that went wrong Loki, was even... The Loki TV show. Yeah, which Loki somehow steals a, <laughs> the stone and breaks the reality of time. And yeah, whatever. Too irrelevant to what we're talking about. Um, but yeah, Vision was interesting. The battle in space. The, yeah, did uh, you see when the crystal that they were gone to the air and they... Both use lightning. Yeah, they both the, use. The, the, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the 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 girl had it turned out to be when they were the, holding the crystal so much. Remember, it's she, like the scene she, with Ray where Ray was, was holding the Ray and Kylo Ren were holding the ship, was, and then but then Ray shoots lightning from her hands, yeah. and I, I as not knowing. So that's what I thought may might, might have happened. But they, they both, are, they're both Sith, so. But they both use lightning and one show that the girls turn out red. red and the hairs turn out blue. They do see Count that? Count Dooku's lightning with blue. But so was Sidious. True. And so was Ray. <laughs> yeah, that's it. <laughs> that, and, yeah, and, yeah. In theory, the son, the, the brother has gone... To the light, supposedly the light side. If she saw the light side, I don't know. I don't know why they changed. They, they I don't have, know. He, Maybe it's just better. Maybe they were trying to describe that. It's just he a change. They associate himself as a Jedi and, this time. But did you know also something I call? He was flying an X-wing. With some he crushed an X-wing. Like, where in the world did he? I he's wonder. Not, he's not dark side anymore. Yeah, and he, he also ends up saving his sister. But then he he crash landed on this planet. And, and he hopes that she recovers. And then the robot okay. basically, we, we don't know, but the way the robot asked him, he was like, I know she's alive. I know uh, she's alive somewhere, and we'll find her. And, he's, uh, and he was like, I know, I, know that, I know that she's alive because she's my twin sister. And, of course, we knew already by the beginning... They are twins because the episode was called The Twin. <laughs> and there's nothing more to... There was nothing there to... Mm-hmm. Not, not be surprised about because of the name of the episode. Yeah. They both have to be twins. Yeah. The, and also they were the only one. There, they were the so. only one. They were the main characters. So the whole Stormtrooper stuff. Did you like how they were... Working like you liked it when the um 
Well, they were in the stormtroopers that was working for the dog, for the sister was trying to shoot the brother, mm-hmm. and somehow the brother could start the blaster. Yeah, I, I actually, I wonder how many people can do that now. I wonder when they start, when the blaster pops, because we don't see it in any well, other... Well, Kylo did that. The yeah. Blaster. So Kylo, yeah, Kylo was the first one that did that, and then we start to see it in, in every single Star Wars movie as we go, and also whip saber. I would want to see somebody with a whip saber in in uh, real in real Star Wars in actual Star Wars, and look, and also the healing part, the healing part when you're wounded, and then they start, and then somehow they start healing you back up. That started in um um uh, right re- that started in the Rise of Skywalker and then it went to Mandalorian and then it went to um and who knows when we're gonna see it again. It's like they're it's like the adding powers, powers in Star Wars. The adding more new ones. And now if you and now in Visions they put the crystal on their chest and then somehow Ah, they had lightning all over their body. And I'm like... It's just strange. It's it's all... different. Yeah, so... Do you have any other last thing to say about Vision? Um... Not really. Mm -hmm. Other than I encourage whoever's out there to... Best to watch these episodes, and maybe you guys that you guys have your own opinions, and and maybe sometime you can we can contact you, and you can contact us, and you can tell us your thoughts. What about you? Do you have any uh, anything to say? No, I, all I would say is yeah. Vision's gonna be an interesting um, thing to finish. We're we there's nine. nine. Yeah, there's nine, nine now. Nine and nine it's so far, so it, far. Yeah, it's gonna be probably something to. Yeah, I don't know. It's something I will look forward to to Star Wars future. It's it's good. It's great. It's not something I'm gonna look forward to because. As much as I like manga, I've read One Punch Man and and a lot of the... I've just read a lot of manga books. And many of them are not very clean, but... Um, oh, no. Not all mangas are clean, but... I read one great one, which was One Punch Man. We need, and we need to wash them. Um, then they will be clean. <laughs> uh, I love mangas. Are, mangas are awesome. It's just... Uh, they are... You just gotta find a good story for them. And I think... Star Wars is... Star Wars manga, I think, are great. It's nice to see a change, I guess. Not... Definitely not Star Wars. Is that is not something I would. Star Wars manga, that especially the I would watch the other episode again. But one episode, just the uh, that band one, I would not. I'm not something I'm gonna. Well, we see include, again. we would want you to watch every once and so that you would, th- yeah. so that you would decide yeah, tell for us yourself. Well, you email us and tell us what you think. And if you like it, you must find yourself watching it more times. What do you say? You you can watch it and have your own opinion, and your own opinion may affect you to do your own decision. I don't know. That's like, what? I'm talking negative about it. <laughs> yeah, it, I'm talking negative about it. He's that. talking negative. <laughs> I'm trying to get you to make your own decision. You make your own opinion. Yeah, I'm talking negative about it, so you don't have to talk negative about it. 
You can enjoy it. Enjoy it. Have freedom. You know, and enjoy it as much of it as you can. You know what? It's kind of sounds like there's two sides of it. One likes it, one does not. One is saying don't watch it. The other one is saying do watch uh, I'm it. I'm not saying don't watch it. I'm just saying... Don't like it at the end. <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm just saying... Uh, not my favorite episode. Episode 2 of Vision. And maybe, maybe. and also they are they're not really that long. They're about fifteen minutes, maybe. So far, we've already saw a few. So um, we'll be in the future. Longer, yeah, but what I'm looking shorter. forward to mostly is uh, a book of Boba Fett, Kenobi, and Bad Batch season two. Yeah. And and though is I, Vision is great. I'm not. I don't get me wrong. Vision is amazing. I like. We could talk about the other ones later on. They are amazing. So yeah, email us and tell us what you think. Um, may the force be with you. May the force be with you. Always. Always.